Hey Siri, do you think I'll marry Carrie? <gasps> hey girls and gays, welcome to the vlog for the week. I'm actually recording this while editing. I was editing the vlog last night and I was like, oh my gosh, I forgot an intro once again. So hi, hello. This is me after Coachella and this vlog is the week before Coachella. And then I also have the Coachella vlog to edit. Who knew being a YouTuber was gonna be a full-time thing? I'm sorry if you feel like I'm slow, I need to like, figure out how to pump it out faster. I'm working on it. So give me some grace. I'm trying to give myself grace. Week was a little hectic that you're about to see. So it might feel a little disorganized, but that makes for the most organic vlogs, right? There were some good moments that needed to be shared. So enjoy and be patient because Coachella vlog is coming very, very soon. Okay, we made it to the salon. It's time for a haircut. It's been almost a year actually since I cut my hair which maybe is bad but <laughs> I want the length I'm trying to grow it wow it's so healthy <laughs> the hair is cut and I'm headed home to Lara we have a few meetings today I feel so good good morning I'm going to a little lunch with House of CB so my friend Alexis is on our way here now and we're meeting a bunch of friends i just wanted to show you guys <laughs> i wish you could see this better oh my god it is so cool well they have wine for us look 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 oh, wait are we the first ones here well those, those girls wow this is the reality it's freezing <laughs> we're out here it's fucking cold making dinner for me and Lara. Pasta. And then we are going to a movie premiere, so. Big news. Oh, really? Harry made me dinner for once. I do it. How often? The last vlog, I did it. Barely. That's not true. But she did a great job right now. I'm going to show you guys. Such a hater. It looks like I have a lazy eye because the camera's to the side instead of the middle. Maybe you just have a lazy eye. Do you look at the camera right when you look at it? Like Wait, this. the camera lens? Yeah. How do you and your mom decide what language to speak? Like, for example, she sometimes she'll text you. And it's English, but sometimes it's Arabic when you talk. So what is it? One, it depends on our mood. If I'm in a public place and I don't want people to understand what I'm saying, I speak Arabic. You guys speak it in front of me sometimes. Does that mean that 
you don't want me to understand what you're saying. When I explain it in Arabic with her in the car and you, it's because I'm re-explaining the same thing. Because she didn't understand me when I said it in English. So I say it again in Arabic and then I'm like, okay, like this is what it means. And I get like frustrated. Um, and then when, when I'm in public and I don't want somebody to understand or I'm like talking about something private, I'll say it in Arabic. Well, yeah, that's a given. I wish I could do that with you soon. Yeah, it's really nice. Um, so like when she texts you just now, she was sending you like a really sweet message, but she's she sent it, it with English. English because she does she can't type she does voice because of her eye. No, I know, but I'm saying so why she didn't did she the, do like, Arabic voice to talk? Like can she speak I, Arabic? Then and it'll it, read in Arabic. Ah, um, oh, yeah. okay, got it. So and she does it, it so she doesn't have to type. Yeah, like she just and you uses can't the read English the, the I actual. Can, I can read Arabic. You didn't know that. Well, yeah, I know, but like, it's not like comfortable. It's like takes you a little bit longer. Yeah, like it. it's not like if I'm reading a contract, I won't understand it. You can read it, but it's like you I don't can practice read... it a lot. So. I... Oh, <laughs> Anna Joanne. Joanne. You still uh, hungry? No. <laughs> Lara Joanne. And Enti Joanne. You know what you say. You know what you say. You know what you say when you're done eating. Shu. Alhamdulillah. Alhamdulillah. Satan Lara. I'm not teaching her religion. You're gonna get your hand in, in my onions. Inti Halloway. Inti Iktir Halloway. What inti command? Oh, a 50. <laughs> me too. You know what you can tell me when I'm eating? Satan. Satan. We need to work on your pronunciation. Is it bad? Yeah. Satan. No. Ten. Sahten. 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 Don't say it like American people. Shuelti? Yeah. <laughs> Listen to me. It's not Sahten. It's Sahten. Mm. It's so sexy when you say it. Sahten. Sah. It's not Sah. Sahten. Sah. Sah. Sahten. There you go. Sah. Hey. When you when it gets cold, cold and you go Anna Bardena Bardene Anna Bardene There you go. My accent from I'm from Colorado, so it's like a I don't know, like a mountain accent is what they what they call it. And right there when I said mountain, I had to try really hard to say mountain. Because normally I want to say mountain. Which mountain. is what the mountain accent is, is we kind of, like there's certain things like you drop the T's on stuff, like cabinet, I don't say like cabinet. You drop the on me. I don't say <laughs> Sorry, guys. toilet, <laughs> I say like toilet. Lit. Lit. Let's teach Carrie something new in Arabic. This is a part of our... Huh? What? You can't say bad words, honey. Yeah, you're right. Is that a bad word? Or do I have to bleep that out? I need to know. Kif petule. Wow, Carrie. This is the best meal I've ever had. Wow, oh. Carrie. Don't say it with a weird accent. You have to say it with the accent. You're saying no, it there, but say it like how you would say it to me. Like, wow, Carrie. Wow, Carrie. The accent <laughs> stays on wow, Carrie. Oh, wow. <laughs> كثير طيبة هالأكلة. أوجي؟ يا. Oh my god. <laughs> make me nervous. Does it make you nervous when I speak the Arabic? Oh, Ooh. by the way, we stuck the hole in the lemon. We tried it. It works. Oh, don't waste the sweet. Don't waste it, babe. Don't waste the lemon. I'm not wasting anything. It was really hard to squeeze it. We have to get dressed right now for this premiere. It's red carpet. I ran into a friend today who said she was wearing a gown. Okay, bye guys. Okay, we'll show you our outfits in a sec. Okay. Ready? Fit check. Well, I gotta make sure that your lipstick is off of me because it's all over. <laughs> Sorry, you got kisses. I'm wearing, uh, my, if, nose, my nose got your lipstick. If we, oh, I'm sorry. 
If we make it in time for the red carpet, I'm wearing these on the red carpet. You see how I'm running? Okay, I gotta go fix this. Hold on. Show us. I wiped a lot of it off with my They're hand. They're gonna see this picture behind you. <laughs> Rihanna got, has the same one! Rihanna has the same one. That's what she tells me every time I it's say, why do we have this girl? I think the person that gave it to me lied to me. It's just a very overpriced print. So I have an attachment to it, but the truth is nobody would buy it. Well, it used to be in the bedroom and I moved it to her bathroom. You know what? <laughs> and he looks at me every time I use the restroom. <laughs> Maybe somebody who's watching this wants it, and if they want it, they can. Do you guys? It. Does anybody want to buy if this? They want it. They don't have to buy it. We'll just give it to them. Great. Yeah, let's Whoever give it to them. Whoever wants it, and they can just DM us their address and tell us that they want it. And if we see it, we'll sign it and we'll send it. Oh my god, I love that idea. <laughs> it's a gorilla smoking a cigarette. Here's the. I don't want to hear anybody in the comments tell me that I should let her keep it because. <laughs> Let's go. Let's it's go. been three years. Oh. We're in Hollywood. It's giving tourist. It's giving tourist. I just told Laura that I hate it here. <laughs> <laughs> There's just a lot of <laughs> intense happenings. Everything's intense. Okay, okay, okay. Me and Lara are the only ones over here who went to get food. Everyone else has drinks. <laughs> okay, we finished the movie and it was amazing. It's called Model House. It's called Model House. It's hilarious. It's kind of like, it's a dark comedy, like a mix between just like new age comedy and a typical killer in the house type of thing, but with a twist. And as two models watching it, there was a lot of accurate jokes and lines and it was really funny. Like you feel slightly targeted, but also. <laughs> Oh god, we forgot our ticket. Or we lost it. Laura lost our ticket. I lost the uh, ticket. But you don't have a ticket? I went to the Chinese theater. It's gonna be $20, okay? Okay. It's so cheaper than that other place. $25 flat fee. Came home and she decided to start trying on outfits for Coachella. My credit card bill is really bad right now. <laughs> oh. A lot of things to return. Oh. We're in Hollywood. We should try to go to him. No, so I agree. So I agree. Can skip all of this. Just be careful. I know. What? <laughs> go, Lorraine, go. We just got back from going out. I just want to say, the place we were at used to be a different club before COVID, called Avenue, mm -hmm. and it was the place we had our first kiss. So we went back to the place that we had our first kiss tonight. Whoa. And then we had that kiss two years before we even started talking or dating. Like it was. Because you didn't want to hang out with me for two. Years. No, I I made out with her at this club called Avenue. And, and fast forward to now, we were in that same room. Fast that we, forward. That we had our first kiss. Oh, no. It was cute. Ended up being a romantic night. It was kind of romantic. There were definitely people pushing and shoving tonight. It was very crowded, but it was romantic nonetheless. It was really hot and sweaty, and we're gonna go rinse and. I'm definitely rinsing. Getting pointy right now. Also, our routine, me and Laura used to go out. A lot when we first met. I just feel like it's kind of a thing you do when you're dating someone. Yeah. But because you're trying to drink and you're trying. We were to younger. Up. Yeah, we were also younger. But also, oh, we have a routine. We come home and we make food because if I drink, it doesn't matter how many drinks I have. I need to eat when I come home before I sleep. It's the best way to prevent a hangover. Hey Siri. 
You think I'll marry Carrie? I'm showing my outfit because it's all pink, including my coffee cup. No. And yours is all beige, including your coffee cup. Oh. Am I blocking you? Where are you? I don't know. I can't really. Oh, you can see my head moving in the distance, like a little ball of head. Hello, hello. So today is the Monday before Coachella, which means I'm headed to a gifting suite in hopes that I can find my final outfit. I have two outfits and I, yes, I don't, it's this weekend and I don't have my third. So it's either going to be, I find something at this showroom or the one I'm going to tomorrow, or I just, God forbid, use something I already have. Very simple. You know, I like the all black chic moment. Actually, wearing this is inspiring me. I'm thinking maybe I should do an all black outfit at Coachella. Also, the worst thing happened to me today. I lost one of my favorite rings. It actually was a ring that I didn't even buy. Like, I found it years ago, like at an after party. But it has sentimental value for some reason. And I'm like, I have no clue where it would have gone because the last time I wore it, all the other rings made it back just fine into my jewelry box. So, um, I will be thinking about that for a very long time, probably forever. I remember every single piece of clothing, etc., that I've lost or hasn't made it back home. Because, I don't know, maybe it's crazy. I used to live in model apartments, and I'm pretty sure one of my favorite pairs of pants was stolen from another model. And I'm still not over it. So anyway, wish me good luck. I want to find my ring. <laughs> if I don't, I'll try to find something similar. But, you know, that was my after party floor ring. I, I don't know what else to say. It was very special. <laughs> Oh my gosh, right. cute. Yeah, you're a little bit taller. You might have to kind of crouch down. Okay, let's go. Okay. You're going to look right here at the camera. It's going to take three shots, okay? Here we go. down the street we're so happy you're so cute it's such a sleigh <laughs> oh right here here's the car okay alexis has work which is a very sad yeah. and you like this song though yeah i love time on the ring It is the week, oh, the week of Coachella, Coachella, which means I spent all day, I didn't vlog, but I spent all day shopping and getting stuff. Great weather. It's amazing weather. I've been in the house I'm all here day. with Laura. And right now we are at Guitar so Center. Um, Laura's holding a gig at Coachella. I look like I'm going to school. Sure if the party's gonna happen, but. Not at Coachella, like an after party. Not at Coachella, it's like a, at, in Coachella Valley, whatever. And they want me to play on a V10, which I've literally never used in my life. So I'm at Guitar Center. To She's like, I'll just try it out, see it. if I can use the board and whatever. So that's what we're doing. Otherwise, I can't do it. <laughs> I should have taken you guys with me. I don't know. I was just totally in my own world today. There's not vlogging, but I got cute clothes. But looking at all the good I wish I could play. I wish you could play them too. I wish I could play piano. I remember seeing it. In this area a while back. So gonna this is it the plan here? Yeah, it's probably this one. I'll, I'll, uh, yeah. Yeah, we'll the Thank you. They really have you in Guitar Center feeling like you're at a concert. <laughs> to check the little shops on Melrose. I need a jacket and I don't know, 
accessories. Just a little. There's cops over here. Melrose is kind of every Scary. place. Every place in LA that is supposed to be cute and fun that maybe used to be is questionable. It smells like weed. It smells like what's your step? Whoa! Sh on the floor. There's too much going on here. We just secured the air wand bag. Oh, we made it just in time with the crossbow. Four turns. Packing journey. This is how you know I'm going to Coachella. I can't decide what bag for my last outfit. Here's my situation. The thing is, is the bag I would want to wear is this, but it doesn't fit a lot. So I put on the jacket I'm wearing. I'm like, there's pocket space, so maybe. I also have my girlfriend and she's really good at carrying my stuff, so that could work. This I've worn before, seems a little loud. This one is my everyday bag. Should I wear my everyday bag at Coachella? <laughs> Cut. <laughs> I'm in the middle of editing my vlog and Laura's gonna do the outro. This is the outro of the video and the next. <laughs> The next video is us going to Coachella. See you there. Stay tuned. <laughs>